rare act of cooperation, Philippine and Chinese Coast Guards worked together to rescue Filipino fishermen whose boat exploded near Bajo de Masinlok. But the rescue mission was still marred by a little bit of tension. Gio Robles with the details. Filipino fishing boat or FFB Akio almost sank near Bajo de Masinlok on Saturday morning. The boat's engine exploded while carrying eight fishermen. The Philippine Coast Guard immediately responded, but while they were towing the sinking boat, a very large Chinese Coast Guard ship was seen just a few meters away from them. The PCG rushed to the area as two fishermen suffered severe burns from the explosion. The Chinese Coast Guard initially attempted to block the responding PCG personnel despite the Philippine side announcing that they were only there to conduct a rescue. Because of China's actions, it took at least three hours for the PCG to rescue the fishermen. In a video released by the PCG, the two Chinese inflatable boats that allegedly blocked the rescue mission can be spotted near the Filipino boat. PCG said China made dangerous maneuvers, but the Chinese side eventually offered help to rescue the fishers from the exploded boat. In a video released by Chinese tabloid Global Times, it can be heard how the CCG offered assistance to rescue the Filipino fishermen. This is China Coast Guard 3105. The fishing boat is sinking. Our vessel is organizing rescue operation. Over. Nung nalaman nila yung rescue mission, they even offered help na magbaba ng kanilang mga rescue personnel. Pero... Siyempre, tayo na ang nag-rescue at uh, alam naman na ng mga kababayan natin na nandun na yung Philippine Coast Guard. The two injured fishermen were transferred by the PCG to BRP Sindangan to be given first aid. The other six fishermen were safe. The Filipino fishers were able to reach Subic Zambales past four in the morning today. The two who sustained severe burns were immediately brought to the hospital. They are currently under observation in the Intensive Care Unit or ICU. Earlier today, PCG Admiral Ronnie Hill Gavan recognized the efforts of the over 60 crew members of BRP Sandangan who responded to the incident. For news 5G Robles, we are one use.